People have always been amazed by natural rock formations. They show up a lot in cultural traditions, act as key landmarks, and draw tourists from everywhere. Some look like whales, some are sandstone waves but cool patterns, and the list goes on. People especially like rock formations that look like people or animals. Even though some of these rocks seem like they were carved by artists, they were all shaped by natural erosion. So buckle up, as we'll talk about 10 amazing natural formations that leave you thinking, is it real? Number 10, Three Whale Rock. Hin Sam 1 or Three Whale Rock is a striking 75 million year old rock formation that stands out from the mountains. It got its name because from the right angle it looks like a family of whales. An aerial view shows that the Three Whale Rock truly resembles a group of whales. It's accessible through a network of trails, making a hike to these massive stone formations a memorable and eco-friendly adventure. Visitors are treated to stunning views of the surrounding forests and amazing vistas. From the top of these whales, you can see the beaches of Mekong, the mountains of the Pakading, district of Lao, and the Fowa Forest. The landscape around Three Whale Rock is surreal, and a full day can easily be dedicated to exploring the area. There are nine different hiking routes to choose from, each offering waterfalls, diverse plant and animal life, and tranquility. If you can, stay for the sunset. It's an unforgettable experience to watch the sun set over Thailand from the top of the giant stone whale. Number 9. Wave Rock Wave Rock is a famous landmark in Western Australia formed about 2.7 billion years ago. Known as Katakich by the Nyungar people, Wave Rock is about 50 feet high and 360 feet long. It forms part of Hayden Rock, located roughly 3 kilometers east of Hayden and 296 kilometers east southeast of Perth, Western Australia. Wave Rock and Hayden Rock are within the 160 hectare. Hayden Wildlife Park, attracting over 100,000 tourists each year. Wave Rock is on the north side of Hayden Rock, a granite inselberg. An isolated rock formation that rises sharply from a flat plain with three domes. The cliff's curved face has been shaped by water erosion from two sources. First, rainwater runs off Hayden Rock and onto the surrounding plains, eroding the granite and creating a wave-like concave slope of Wave Rock. Second, as the granite cliff has eroded over time, groundwater has seeped to the surface, depositing chemicals that create the striped pattern seen today. Number 8. Eye of the Sahara the Eye of the Sahara, known as the Raikat structure, is a massive geological formation in Mauritania that creates a bull's eye of sorts in the Sahara Desert, also known as the Guelb, a Raikat. It's a striking circular geological feature located in the Adral Plateau of the Sahara, near Oadone in Mauritania. In the local dialect, Raikat means feathers, and it's also locally referred to as Tagint, which describes the circular opening of a leather pouch used for drawing water from wells. This feature is an eroded geological dome, 40 kilometers in diameter, with sedimentary rock layers forming concentric rings. Inside there are ingenious rocks, including impressive rhyolites and gabbros that have been altered by hydrothermal processes, along with a central megabretture. The Rikat structure is notable for its significant collections of Achillean archaeological artifacts. Number 7. Thor's Hammer Hoodoos are tall, slender rock spires found in dry basins and Bryce Canyon National Park. In southwestern Utah is famous for having the most of them. Thor's hammer is a particularly photogenic hoodoo with a wide top that looks like a hammer on a 150-foot tower. The hoodoos in Bryce Canyon formed about 40 to 60 million years ago through a process called frost wedging. Melting snow seeps into rock cracks and freezes, expanding when the temperature drops. With over 200 freeze-thaw cycles each year in Bryce Canyon, this process is very effective. Number 6. Queen's Head Queen's Head, a 26-foot tall mushroom rock located in northern Taiwan, is a major draw for around 2.5 million visitors every year. Situated within the 24-acre Yale Yujia Park, it stands out for its striking resemblance to the profile of a woman's head. The unique shape of mushroom rocks like Queen's Head is a result of a special type of weathering process. While wind-blown sand is the main force behind erosion, its lifting capacity is limited, leading to more erosion at the lower part of the rock. Over time, this results in a larger and more textured top. Despite being around for over 4,000 years, this sandstone marvel is facing challenges. The erosion has progressed to the point where the head is becoming too heavy for its slender neck. Number 5. Rock Sites in Cappadocia 
The rock site of Cappadocia near Kayseri, Turkey, showcased a fascinating geology born from volcanic activity. This area, nestled within Gorim National Park, is renowned for its enchanting fairy chimneys. These towering rock pillars, formed from volcanic ash, solidifying over time and shaped by elements, reach heights of up to 130 feet, creating a surreal landscape. Starting around the 4th century, people began carving into these unique rock formations, creating cave dwellings, places of worship, and even entire underground towns. Some of these structures are said to extend as deep as eight stories underground. Initially used by monks and Christians escaping prosecution, these cave dwellings now serve as museums and historical dwellings for visitors to explore and appreciate. Number 4. Pamuk Hill Pamuk Hill, often hailed as one of the most breathtaking places on Earth, is a mesmerizing site in southwestern Turkey. Picture expansive terraces resembling cotton castles, gleaming in brilliant white against the backdrop of azure blue pools. The name Pamukkale translates to Cotton Castle in Turkish, perfectly describing the stunning white rock formations crafted from calcite. These terraces are adorned with travertine basins, brimming with thermal spring water rich in calcite, leaving behind delicate white deposits as cascades over the edges, creating a scene straight out of a dream. What's even more enchanting are the petrified waterfalls formed by the thick calcite deposits, sculpting mesmerizing waves on the rocks. For centuries, locals and visitors alike have soaked in the natural pools, immersing themselves in this ancient tradition. Number 3. Sphinx of Balochistan Egypt may have the famous Great Sphinx of Giza, but Pakistan's Hingol National Park boasts its own natural wonder, a sphinx carved by the forces of wind and rain. Perched atop a mountain along the Makran Coastal Highway, about 155 miles from Karachi, this remarkable rock formation is part of a rugged landscape filled with canyons and bluffs. Interestingly, it wasn't until 2004, during the construction of the road, that this unique sphinx was uncovered. And that's not all the Makran Coastal Highway has to offer. Visitors can also marvel at other distinctive rock formations like the Princess of Hope, a rock resembling a human figure towering proudly above a heap of rocks. Number 2. Heart Rock Heart Rock is this adorable rock formation tucked away in California, close to a waterfall. What makes it stand out is its super cute heart-shaped dip on its surface. And get this, there's even a little pool of water chilling in the middle of it. Nearby, Seely Creek Falls adds to the whole charm by flowing over the rock when the creek is full, making the view even more picturesque. The water from the 20-foot falls is like the artist behind the masterpiece, slowly carving out this unique shape over time. You can find Heart Rock near Westline, California, nestled in the San Bernardino National Forest. And the best part, you can easily reach it by taking a one-mile hike through the forest. Number 1. Wulingyuan you know those crazy floating islands in James Cameron's Avatar? Well, they got their inspiration from the jagged sandstone pillars of Wollongong. It's like, seriously, some of the most mind-blowing scenery out there. The place is famous for its jaw-dropping landscape, boasting over 3,000 quartzite sandstone pillars and peaks, many towering over 200 meters high. But that's not all. Wollongong is also home to ravines, gorges, streams, pools, lakes, rivers and waterfalls that could rival any postcard-perfect scene. You won't be bored here either, with 40 caves to explore, some of them adorned with impressive calcite deposits. Plus, there's this incredible natural bridge called Tiangya Sheng Kong, which translates to Bridge Across the Sky. It's one of the highest natural bridges on Earth. Well, that's it for today. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for regular updates. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Thanks for watching the video, and we'll catch you in the next one.